Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to day 733 of trying a new makeup product every day. Today, I am so excited to be trying out these beautiful liquid lipsticks. So what I have here is the Alter Ego Matte Liquid Lipstick. So if you saw my small YouTuber PR unboxing video that I did recently, you would have seen these and how excited I was to get them. And so if you haven't seen that video, I will have that linked down below. But oh my gosh, so like I just said, I did get these in PR, so a disclaimer that these were sent to me for free, but this video is not sponsored. These are going to be all my own thoughts and opinions. But oh my gosh, my first thought is that this is one of the most beautifully packaged products I've ever seen. Even the box it comes in, it's like a soft box. I don't know, it just seems so luxurious. But guess what? These only cost $6 each. Even better, you can get all six colors in the collection for only $28. That is like mind blowing to me because $28 is the price of one liquid lipstick from like Sephora or Ulta for some of those higher end brands. But this packaging looks more beautiful than those high end brands. So I'm really excited to see how this looks and how it applies, everything about this. But before I try them out on my lips, I am gonna go ahead and swatch each color that I have. So this first one that I'm swatching is called Crush and they have a doe foot applicator, which the doe foot applicator seems luxurious, but that one swipe, so pigmented, full opaque color, which this is a gorgeous color. I'm really drawn to these like pinky nude shades. So I'm really excited about this shade crush. And then I've got the shade Intrigue, ooh, which is more of like a orangey brown shade. Then we've got the shade Vanity. Whoa, this is a gorgeous deep red shade. I thought it was gonna be more of like an orangey brown, but no, that's like a true red. That is beautiful. That one's called Vanity. Next up, I'm swatching Infamous. Ooh. Oh, I actually am really curious how that shade would look on me because it's kind of like a burgundy purple, but then it's also kind of maroon. Oh, I really, really like that. Infamous. Maybe that's the one I'll put on my lips today. And then I have the shade Euphoria. Ooh. Gorgeous nude shade. That's like a my lips but better shade. Love that. I love all of these colors. So here's a better view of those swatches. Like look at how pigmented. You have such a nice creamy texture. Like it's not a very thin, watery liquid lipstick. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead, looking at the swatches, they all seem to be like that same formula. So I'm just going to be applying the shade Infamous to my lips. And well, let's see. Is there a scent to this? I'm not really getting any sort of fragrance. It kind of smells product-y, but it's so faint, I really wouldn't say that there's a smell to this much at all. Like the more I smell it, the more I can't smell anything. <laughs> but okay, here we go. This is such a nice, soft doe foot applicator. 
that's still small enough that you can get very precise. Like I don't feel like I need a lip liner with this in order to get the smooth, even edges. And I just did one layer, which looking at it in camera looks pretty <laughs> bold and dark, but in my mirror, the color is full even, but I feel like it's not 100% opaque intense. Like you can just do this one layer and it's a little bit more toned down, but I really want to add that second layer and build this up to the full dark color. So buildable. Wow, yeah, this does get very dark. It's got those red, purpley tones to it. And I just think this color is so beautiful and unique and interesting. I love it, but I don't just love the color. This formula is perfect. As you saw, it applies so easily. It glides right on and you have full, opaque, even color. My lips look hydrated, which as always, they were not hydrated before I applied this, but they still look smooth. No clinging to dry patches. It has a beautiful matte finish that's not chalky or flaky, and it feels so comfortable on my lips. Now I'm really curious if there's transfer. That is barely any transfer for this color in this amount of product on my lips, but it didn't fade in the least. So, this is definitely going to be long lasting. Like if you've seen my lip <laughs> product review videos, you would know that this is exactly what I look for in my lip products. I want it to look full, even opaque, and I want it to be long lasting. And this is absolutely all of the above. Now let's see, no stickiness either just so comfortable on my lips. It actually feels like it's moisturizing and creamy on my lips, but then it's matte. So this formula is perfect. I can't believe that this is a $6 liquid lipstick. First of all, like the packaging alone, I would pay more than $6 for because this just looks so beautiful. Displayed in my makeup collection, when I pull it out of my purse in public, this is gorgeous. This looks expensive, but then the formula is amazing. So this is just all around so impressive. I am so thankful that they sent this to me and so, so thankful and excited that I get to show you this. I know that a lot of you were interested in this product when I featured it in my unboxing video. And oh my gosh, this lives up to my expectations, my hopes for this product. I highly recommend. I will have it linked in the description down below because you should definitely check these out. All of these colors. I'm so happy I have them because these are all liquid lipsticks that I'm going to reach for all the time. And you're supporting those smaller indie beauty brand businesses, which I love to do. I also need to mention that this is cruelty free. So I love that as well. Well, thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.